What's good, Pack Horse family, baby? Welcome back to another edition of Pack Horse and Powers, baby. <laughs> Listen, I want y'all, I want somebody out there, I want you to. I want you to take a deep breath, and I want you to, when you exhale, I, before you take that deep breath, I want you to think about something in your life that's burdening you, something that got you worried, somebody, something that got you concerned, something that got you down. I want you to, before you take that deep breath, I want you to think about that, and as you take your deep breath, hold it in, and as you blow it away, I want you to blow that thing away. I want you to blow that worry. I want you to blow that concern away. I want you to do it. Listen. I'm not here all that easier said and done stuff. Listen, I want you to know that we, I serve a God that, so, that can do exceedingly and abundantly above all things that we can ever imagine, Pack Horse family. I was reading in Ephesians this morning and I came across that. And I want to give you another, another scripture that I came out of Ephesians with. Every so often, man, like you, you read these same scriptures all the time, but I guess depending on the, your situations in life, things impact you in a different way. But listen to here. I ran into Ephesians 1 and uh, 1, chapter 1 and verse 19. And it says, what is the exceeding greatness of his power to us work who believe according to the according to the workings of his mighty power? Did y'all catch that? If you didn't, just rewind it. The key word in there for me was believe. Listen, y'all know my favorite verse is Matthew 21 and 22. If you believe, if you believe and do not doubt, you will receive what you ask for in prayer. And understand what I'm saying. You got to know that you got to know that God answers prayer, but you got to also understand he don't answer every single prayer right when he wants us to, but he always out here working. Listen, he always putting their work in the background. He always, listen, I know I serve a God that's so on time. He aligns certain things. He aligns certain people. He aligns certain situations according to his graces and his power. And then he unleashes them at the right time so we can sit back and see and say, well, look at God. Look at God. Well, look at God. Ain't it ain't nothing that he won't do in the worsens of the storm. Either you can sit back and you can relish in your storm and you can let the storm drown you and overtake you. Or you can ask yourself, God, what did you try? Christ, God of Christ, what are y'all trying to teach me? What are you trying to teach me? What are you trying to learn me in this situation? Because everything come to help you grow. Understand what I'm saying? So you can either look at it as a burden or you can look at it as something that's going to be helping you get to your next level. Because champions always find new ways to win. And in Pack Horse Family, we champion, baby. We always find new ways to win. But I ran across, I ran across that verse in Ephesians, man. And it said the exceeding greatness of his power. Don't underestimate, don't under don't underestimate Christ. Don't underestimate God and the power that they bring. Understand what I'm saying? Because it's this mighty, it's glorious, it's redemption, it's overcomeness, it's forgiveness, it's all that tied up into one. And we'll never understand why he do what he do. He give, he take it away. And we'll never understand why. But it's not up for us to understand why. It's up to us to keep believing. I feel like in my life, if I'm gonna believe now, I gotta believe always. I can't walk that contradictive line. Understand what I'm saying, Pack Horse Family. So as I'm out here learning, as I'm out here growing, as I'm out here increasing my face, faith, as I'm out here standing in the household of faith, and I want y'all to do the same, Pack Horse Family. And this all be centered around my purpose. I promise to you, this all centered around my purpose. You gotta do, you gotta do some soul searching. You gotta do some deep diving to find that thing. You gotta ask yourself some tough questions. You got to go through the storm. You got to go through the mess. Understand, you can't expect to walk through this life unscathed. Understand what I'm saying? We can't. We can't, Pack Horse family. But listen, I want you to look your situation directly in the eye. I want you to look your situation directly in the eye. And I want you to tell it. You didn't come to back down. I want you to tell it. You didn't come to back down. I want you to look your situation directly right in the eye as I wrote on this paper and tell her I didn't come to back down. I didn't come this far now just to turn around and go back. I didn't come this far now to let you defeat me. I didn't come this far now to not dry them tears out my eyes. I ain't come this far now not to do any of those things, Pack Horse Family. Listen, and I want y'all to hit that like button for me. I want y'all to subscribe for me. I want y'all to send this to somebody that need to hear this. Understand what I'm saying? understand what I'm saying and I want to end it with this Pack Horse family I want to end it with this what's your standard for your life what's your standard what's your standard for your life Pack Horse family
I want you to understand what's your standard. What you gonna put up with? What you not gonna put up with? What you gonna be willing to overcome? What you gonna be willing to keep trying to do? Listen, because in life, we gotta pay attention to patterns. We gotta pay attention to patterns, man. I've been sitting back in my life and I've just been paying attention. I've been looking at my environment, man. And I was thinking about this one situation that I almost walked back into. But I noticed the same pattern. I got patterns too. But I want y'all to pay attention to the patterns of the people, of your patterns, and the patterns of people around you. And if you ain't rocking with their patterns, best believe, if they keep doing the same old thing, that's within them. Cause it ain't, it ain't about, it's about what's in you. Understand what I'm saying, Pack Horse family, listen. I'm praying for everybody that's going through some 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 hard times. I'm praying I'm praying for all you people that's going through some hard times. I'm praying for all those people who feeling like they want to give up. I'm praying for all those people who feel like life just a little bit too heavy. God is always with you. If you believe now, I want you to believe always, Pack Horse family. I want you to believe always. And I want you to live out a high standard for your life because greatness is within. Greatness is the ones who overcome. Greatness is the ones who endure. Greatness is in the ones who persevere. The greatness is in the ones who keep the faith. Even when you don't know where that faith will take you, Pack Horse family. I love y'all. Thanks for tuning in. Peace, success, and prosperity.